Just congratulations on the victory against North Shore tonight. You still have one game left. So what'd you tell the guys in that huddle at midfield after the game? Well, first I congratulate them on a heck of a job. Um, they executed the game plan. They, they were just physical tonight with a, a big physical team. And I think we just warmed down at the end. Uh, talked about uh, next week, you know, how big and important that is for playoff seating. And, uh, you know, told them to stay and keep the same attitude we had this week, be calm, be poised, get out there, do what you got to do to win the ball game. And that, I think that was a big key to it. Those, those kids just didn't get caught up in all the hype and all the things that were going on and just played football. Talk about that. As you, as you speak, the helicopter's leaving now for one of the recruiting schools. Talk about as that comes in, your team still stays focused and actually starts playing their best football, especially on defense, stopping North Shore. With all the excitement, do you have to give a lot of credit to the kids for keeping their composure and yeah. making sure they did, you know, play to the final whistle? Big thing, you know, we beat them last year. We kind of got that monkey off our back. The intimidation factor wasn't there. We knew we just had to settle down, be smart, play good football, and that's what they did. All right, Coach, so moving forward, um, how big is next week? compared to jumping into the playoffs and starting that 0-0 zero zero record, making a run at state. It's big, you know, not only district title, you know, you got a three-way tie sitting there, but, uh, you know, the seeding into the playoffs is, is big, you know, and you want to go in as a, the small division two, you know, number one seed, that's where you want to be. All right, Coach, well, congratulations, and y'all enjoy it. Thank you so much.